Good evening, party people. So, um, a couple things, a couple things, okay? So, in our reflection, the last couple of weeks, um, earlier today, it just really hit me like, <laughs> yo, I am not the same Meg. Can y'all relate? There have been different things, good and bad, that's been going on. Um, just with a, um, I do feel like an increased anointing in this hour. God, I told y'all he dropped some stuff down on your girl going into October. Um, and I just know I'm not the same. And that's, I can't say I've ever been in this place, right? Like this, this is new for me. Um, I'm not the same Megan, just not the same reactions, whether it's been, um, the devil trying me through people or it's been him trying me through situations. Like I just don't even react like the old me, like my faith is solid and I pray it continues to be that way. And so I'm thankful. And so when I realized that today, I ended up walking into my kitchen. Coming in my kitchen. And what I made as the thumbnail is actually what I did at the new year, right? So it says new you 2021. I think every year we go into it hoping and praying like stuff will actually change, will actually change. This is the first time ever in my life where not ever in my life, but to this extent, right? Each round goes higher and higher that I truly feel like a new me. And so what we've been reflecting on and what God has been telling us is like, that's where it starts. You have to become a new you in order for the things around you to become new. We have to be restored to him in order for restoration to take place in our lives. And so for me, it's been interesting because I feel like I'm dreaming most days, right? I feel like I'm in a constant state of deja vu, but it just kind of, sometimes it just hit me like, hey, like, low-key kind of like unbelievable, guy, you know? And so I was wanting to share, this in me feels like a miracle. Y'all get what I'm saying? Like, so of course I'm about to see miracles all around me. And same for y'all. Um, I wanted y'all to know that he's proud of us. He relayed that to me and my sis in Christ. Shout out to my J. I I love you. But um, he's proud of us. Like, he's proud of us. And that was a good feeling to feel that. Like, I, I'd be happy when my, my uh, earthly father is proud of me, okay? To know that my heavenly father is proud of me. And he's still saying to keep going. Remember, he said to keep going so we can see these promises, these things face to face. So we got to keep pushing, okay? Like, y'all wouldn't even know the difference that the devil been throwing at me because I'm a new Megan. Like, you're going to have to come harder, sir, okay? I ain't her no more. So... I just wanted to let y'all know that and just, can y'all relate? Like, do y'all feel the same? Are y'all where we are? Because, look, he said, it's going to be a new you stepping into this new season. I feel like I got a new life. I'm serious. Like, welcome to your new life. Like, do y'all not receive that? Do y'all not feel that? Let us know, okay? Comment down below. Comment, new me, new life. If you feel this, okay, if you if your spirit receives this like ours has, new me, new life. Like y'all, I told her earlier today on the phone, it's up and it's stuck. Like there's no going back. Even if I wanted to go back, there is no going back at this point. Okay. So let's stay focused. Let's stay humble. Let's continue to cling to him because I said that in a previous word before too. The new life, you need him even more than you needed him before. It don't ever become, oh, I got it, I got it, and we don't need him. No, 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 no. You need him even more, okay? New levels, okay? Y'all have a great night. Love y'all.